So some other useful things we can do in Word to sort of increase the font size is uh, just use a couple of shortcut keys to, to make the font size a bit bigger. Obviously you could go up to the A's up here and click them to make the font size bigger or use the drop down menu but it's much quicker using some keyboard shortcuts. So let's take this one for example, I'm holding the shift key down on the keyboard, the shift key down and I'm just pressing the the down arrow just to really highlight that text because that's the text where I want to increase the text size. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to use the control key plus the kind of open bracket key to uh, let's see zoom in the text by by one point. So if I press the control key down and it's like the open bracket type of key, I'm not sure the actual name for it, but if I press that down you can see how it's just mag yeah, well, sorry just zooming up by a, by a, a, an increment. So if you look at the text size where it says Calibri body it's like 16, 17, 18 and equally just to take it back down again hold the control key and let's just take that back down again using the um, close or the close bracket. So open and close bracket uh, and on my laptop they're just next to the enter key and the P so let's just do that. Okay, so that's by one. If we wanted to do it by two, the other way we could do it is by, by pressing and holding down the control key and shift key and the greater than sign. So the shift key and the greater sign and that's doing it by two. So two and then the lesser sign will take it back out again. Like that. And actually here's just by the way, sometimes students might leave the caps lock key on and everything's type, typed up in capital letters, well one thing you can do is just by pressing the shift key and the F3 key is that you can toggle, so there, there's the caps lock one, you can toggle between uppercase, sentence case and lowercase, that takes it back. So student types, uh, pupil types and they've left the caps lock on and they, that's the sort of thing you get, well just highlight that paragraph or highlight the document, shift and F3 will toggle you between those two.